Welcome back to LGS Microscopes. My name is Paul and today I'm going to show you how to use a teaching head on a microscope. Now some of you might have one of these microscopes that has a second head. Now what's that all about? The purpose of this is so that you can have a second person looking at the same sample at the same time. So what we're going to do is go through our setup the same way as we did before. You can always look at our Microscopy 101 video to reference that. So what we're going to do is we're going to use this eyepiece that does not have anything special on it. We're going to get our, our sample in focus there first. Now I'm going to use the same sample as the last video just so it all looks the same and familiar. Using the coarse and fine focus to get a good image. So now what we want to do is set it up for the second person. Now we're going to swing this around and you'll notice that this other eye tube has this ring on here and as you turn it, it will move the eyepiece in and out. So what we're going to do is now that it's in focus on this eyepiece, we're going to look through here and just adjust this until it's in focus for both of you. And that looks pretty good. Now the purpose of this is because not everybody's eyes are the same. You can fine tune this for the second person now so that you can both see the same thing and focus at the same time. This is great for teaching or if you're splitting a microscope between two separate students. Sometimes there will even be a pointer in the eyepieces so that you can point at a specific feature and then you'll both know what you're talking about. And that's how you use a teaching microscope to show the same image to two different people at the same time. Thanks for stopping by. This is LGS Microscopes. You can always Contact us with questions or comments at info at lgsmicroscopes.com or you can call us at 623-240-2232. Thanks.